Hello guys, welcome to another video. My name is Jake. This is Jake B Tech. Today I'm going over what's on my Android phone. To be more precise, what's on my Sony Xperia Z smartphone. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Visit the phone workshop Cranny for great deals on phone repair, unlocking and accessories. Link in video description. So as you can see here, we are on the home screen. As I said, we would be. This is the Google Now launcher. This is the chosen lock screen I've got. Over here you get all your news, weather updates and travel updates. So I find this helpful as it also sometimes shows my calendar. It's got current location, weather and it's just overall quite useful. So getting onto the actual home screen, let's go into the Google folder. Here we've got Google Allo, which has a Google Assistant. So you could talk to the Google Assistant. Let's talk to the Google Assistant. What's the weather like? And then it's going to give me the weather. So it says you may need a raincoat. It's like Siri, but it's not again, because it doesn't talk back to you. But then it's like Google Now, Google Now, but more advanced or just like OK Google. But it's more advanced than this. I don't want to set it up yet. And then over here we've got the YouTube Studio app. We all know what this is for. It's basically to see what's happening on your YouTube channel. I'm going down and everything as I'm uploading less frequently because of school. Then we've got Spotify, which I don't use that much, but hopefully we'll start using again as there might be a way to get free Spotify Premium, which I may make a video about in the near future. I just left this folder for some bizarre reason, but let's go back to the folder. <laughs> so this is Google Fit, so it counts all my steps on what I get on my smartwatch, so it says, I'm so close to getting my steps. So then it just connects to the app on my phone and then it just tells me how many steps I've done so far today. Moving back into the folder, not forgetting, here we've got Google Duo. This is a basically a version of FaceTime but for Android and iOS. So as you see, I've got my Sony HX60 here. And then over here, you have me recording this video with my lav mic for some reason hanging down. I'm not gonna touch it. Otherwise, I will probably ruin the audio for this video. Sorry about that, guys. Now we have Google Auto, I don't know why I've got it, but it's just in the Google folder. Then we've got the Google keyboard here. This is so I can leave it as stock as I've got a Sony phone. Then we've got Google Play Music, which I don't use as I've got the other voice recorder, which I'll, or oh no, music player, which I'll get into a bit. And then we've got Voice Access, which is a new app by Google that isn't yet released. I'm not really sure how it works properly, as you've got to click there to activate it each time, which I don't really like about it. So now we can come out of this folder and go into the phonograph folder or app. This is a music playing app. This is my preferred music playing app. I've got my albums here, which I, I've made this album. So it's got some of my favorite songs there. And that's some of my favorite songs there. Then we've got the favorites here, which I just harp the songs I like. This is all from Now94 stuff, really. But I've done a bit more in depth on this app in my top five video, which I'll leave up there somewhere for you to go and have a look at. We've done Spotify as I did that earlier for some reason, but now let's get into the school folder. So I've got Google Keep, which basically lets you take notes like it does on iOS but this is basically the Android version. Then we've got Google Classroom, which basically lets my teacher set assignments for our classes. And then we just upload the files when we finished for the files we've used 
for that so the teachers can mark our work. Then uh, we've got Google Calendar, which my school have actually used. So they've put my timetable on. As you can see on Monday, I've got maths, maths, science, computing, curriculum study, and then English. Then we've got Sheets, which is uh, basically uh, Excel for Google. So on Google Drive, then we've got Google Docs, which is like Word, but on Google. Then we've got Gmail, which is for my, all my emails. So I'll go into there to show you if you don't for some reason know what Gmail is. So here we are. This is just basically my school emails. Then we have uh, Google Slides, which then lets me make slides like in PowerPoint. So then we've got Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram and Messenger. So this is basically my social medias, you know what they are. Then we've got my Messenger down here which is basically messaging. Then we've got, uh, what's it called, Studio again, which is the same app. Then we've got Chrome and my camera so I can take pictures. If you like the video, please give the video a thumbs up. If you dislike the video, dislike the video and tell me why down below in the comment section. My name has been Jake, this has been Jake Patek, I'll see you in my next video.